so clearly this partnership with Sirius XM has played a huge role in your success. So what was that process like? It's like that artist going to the radio station with their tape to play my yeah. song, please. You kind of had to do that to Sirius. So what was that process like to try and get them to convince you to be part of their game? So, yeah, and I mean, you know, I feel like it's a milestone for us. We turned 20 years old this year, Holy Culture, and a lot of milestones along the way. This clearly is a significant one that is, to me, significant for the community because it allows us to provide a platform to so many artists. We've played well over a thousand artists since we've launched. I would say the process is one, 10 years ago, we tried it this and we didn't get the, the deal, right? And so they have a process at which they look at programming that serves historically underrepresented populations mm -hmm. and considers. So every five years or so, I think they will open up a process and you can put in a proposal to lease a channel. And that's essentially what we did. And it's a thick proposal, right? Probably 60, 70 pages that includes everything from the concepts, the audiences we want to reach, why we want to reach those audiences and the impact we hope to make, the financials, all the shows, and what a five-year plan looks like. You know, what, what will we do over those five years? That's a high-level summary of it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 